You know, am I mass manufacturing videos? Is that what I'm- is that- <laughs> Is that gonna be the thing I'm known for? Mass manufactured Let's, let's Plays? God, I don't know if that'd be a good or bad thing. If- oh my god. <clears throat> I don't know. If if I was known for my tenaciousness and my ability to uh, make a fuckload of videos, I'd be okay with that. I'd be happy. Oh, by the way, though, also, uh... <sighs> okay, so what was my... There was something. Ooh, nice crystals. There, there was something. Um... <laughs> Sorry, I love that I, I did check. I did see that the water is safe on this planet. Um, and of course it's water and lead. Uh, and that's... that's <laughs> seems... <laughs> Uh, it's fun. Um, no traits, but clearly there is something. I think there is at there is some point some if the gravity is low enough, I think you could probably infinitely boost pack. Theoretically, across completely flat terrain. Point twelve might be it. <laughs> Maybe. Well, again, we're like at a little bit of a higher terrain here, so we're gonna have to like. Ooh, okay. Let's let's try and get a little bit more height. <laughs> um. Uh, oh my god, this is so far away! <laughs> you know what, we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Uh, I'm trying to- sorry, I'm trying to focus and think, which I- am, I'm dumb bun. Oh god. You know, that's, that's one of the things with 3D printing. Oh, we're not gonna be able to do this. Yeah, I'll try. Um, a fursuit head base. That that would be that would be something that theoretically I could print. Be interesting to see. Um, be interesting to design, because it probably wouldn't be able to fit on the printer. It's like a three hundred by I think it's three hundred by three hundred by three forty or three fifty millimeters. And I don't know if that's big enough for, say, a motorcycle helmet, but, um... If it's big enough for a motorcycle helmet, it, um, might not necessarily be big enough for a, um, fursuit head base. Oh, we're gonna... At least, we've got a pretty good... Oh, well, we are dropping an elevation here, so I have a solid... Ch I'm using the, um, the... Oh, oh god. I, um... Oh, jeez. I was using the, um, line between the ammo, the max ammo, and the, uh, the, the line between the grenade and the number. <laughs> that one? I was using that as a marker. Oh, and I just, like, double dipped. So I've got a... 
know that. At least I have a very, very uh, good <laughs> indication of um, how long... Whenever I do drop, I'll know exactly when... Or how long I went. I, I know I didn't go straight from the ship, so... Or I didn't do this straight from the ship, so it's... And of course I have a little bit of that movement, so it's not an exact number. Or a little bit of side to side. Oh, we're gonna... Oh! Oh! Yeah! Woo! We did not touch the ground until we found the thing. How, that's kind of cool. <laughs> uh, and that's the kind of fun you gotta make in a sandbox game. Oh, you know, it's also a weird thing that this thing doesn't have a... Okay, so this doesn't have a scope. The, right? I'm not insane. When I'm looking at this, there is no scope on it. You know what? Actually, I, okay, so I got this from the... Um, I got this from the... the Constant, the e ECS constant, the the lost uh, colonists thing. I'm pretty sure, um, not with all of these mods, but I got, but I got this, um, and I think it did have, it visibly did have a scope on it, and it does have the scope, and it does actually like work as having a scope, but it doesn't have it. I don't know. Well, that was some dumb fun, but that's exactly what sandbox games are about, so. Until next time, have a good day, great day, even. Showskies.